drop a like on this video in the next five seconds if you guys want to redeem all these V-Buck codes on your own Fortnite accounts. What's going on friends and welcome back to a brand new Fortnite's Battle Royale video here onto the channel. Today's video we are going to be looking at a few brand new hidden rewards that were found in the Fortnite files and teased in some upcoming trailers that are going to be coming out into the game into the next downtime update which is very very soon. So make sure you guys stick around to the very end of the video. I'm going to be showing you guys exactly how we're going to be able to get these free rewards that are a little bit secretive. Before we get into that though we got to go ahead and send our daily gift to a lucky subscriber. Now unfortunately the double agent pack finally left the shop. I feel like I should have sent someone else that one more time before it left, but we do have the Black Manta still, and other than that, I don't think we have anything new. I'm not gonna lie, the shop is slacking just a little bit today. But you know what? I think I'm gonna go ahead and send the Cloaked Shadow skin to someone, mainly because I think this skin actually looks really cool. I know a lot of people love this back bling as well, so why not? Today's gift is going to Lil Angel 93 so shout out to you for supporting the channel, and if you guys wanna be like Angel and receive a gift in a future video, all you have to do is drop a like make sure you are subscribed to the channel with notifications turned on and also leave your epic usernames down in the comment section below so i can add you and send you the gift and if you guys are going to be buying anything in the fortnite shop right now make sure to use supporter creator code nerpa you guys have been killing the support recently like honestly it's been amazing so thank you to everyone that is using my code you guys are legends and just a friendly reminder once you guys hit 30,000 supporter creator users on code nerpa i will be a default skin in fortnite for an entire month so if you guys want me to look like a noob make sure to use my code we're doing something that i normally never do when i record for videos we're here playing some solos mainly because blitz was the ltm and i actually really like blitz really fast paced i'm probably just going to end up getting destroyed over and over um but we'll see what happens like i said i'm usually kind of a squad player not really a solo kind of guy so i'm I'm a little bit nervous. So like I said, today we're going to be looking at some hidden and secret rewards that most of you guys have probably already seen for yourselves because they were found in the Fortnite files and a few of these rewards are skins that were actually teased in trailers released throughout season three. And thanks to some data miners, we finally have some confirmation on how we're going to be getting some of these free rewards. Some of them are honestly really, really cool. And the first big chunk of them that we are going to be looking at actually have to do with the upcoming car update and also the update that's going to be bringing in Atlantis into the game. Oh God, I forgot the zone moves, dude. The zone moves so fast. Dude, you can't even, you can't be serious, man. This is why I don't do solos. I just die so fast. And this guy is cracked. All right, well, for some reason, it wasn't finding a game. I don't know if the servers are messed up or what, but uh, I might actually just have to go play some squads because I was sitting here for like five minutes searching for a game and it didn't, it didn't load me into anything. All right, well... I got destroyed in solos, so we're back in squads. I feel a little bit safer now. <laughs> I'm just not good enough. I'm not good enough to play solos in this game. Like, I feel like you have to be, you literally have to be World Cup qualifier to play solos these days with how good everyone is. But like I was saying before I died in that last game, some of these hidden rewards that we are looking at, you guys have probably already seen, but maybe overlooked it because they are very subtle. And like I said, Fortnite kind of put them in the background of some trailers to kind of give us little teasers and to see if anyone in the community would actually realize. Now, the trailer that the first skin and hidden reward that we are going to be taking a look at today was featured in was the Aquaman trailer which of course Aquaman skin came out a few days ago here in Fortnite they also released a special trailer for it which which in the trailer it showed Aquaman and it also showed the Black Manta skin as well because that is a part of the DC universe and it was released into the shop around the same time Aquaman was officially out in Fortnite what are you doing wait what what was that why was he is this guy shooting me through the wall Be sneaky, be sneaky. The P90 is too good. Let's go. Let's go, dude. The P90 is actually insane. Now, I'm assuming most of you guys have seen this Aquaman trailer that I'm referring to. If not, I'm going to put it on the screen. I'm going to play the full trailer out because it is pretty short. And I'm going to see if you guys could actually find what part of the trailer I am talking about in terms of like a hidden free reward that we are going to be getting.
So did you see it? Oh, I'm really curious if any of you guys actually caught that. But the part of the trailer that I am referring to is at the very end, whenever it shows Aquaman walking out. If you guys look in the background, there's actually a few different hidden Easter eggs here. The first Easter egg that a lot of people noticed is in the background, you guys could see that this is pretty much teasing what the Atlantis point of interest is, uh, is going to look like here in Fortnite once it is released into the game, which of course, it was found in the files a long time ago. This is one of the biggest points of interest and probably one of the biggest map changes that we will see throughout the entirety of season three. And in the background, you can see kind of like a blurry, unfocused image of what it's going to look like, which obviously is really exciting, hyped up a lot of people. And I'm not going to lie, based on the images and stuff that we can see here, I think it's going to be awesome. But the thing I want to focus on is actually the brand new fish stick variant that we are going to be getting as a free style that is right next to Aquaman in the background. Unfortunately, at the moment, we don't know officially what the name of this skin is going to be, but as you guys can see here, this is an unreleased style for the fish stick skin. And in this trailer or like little storyline, they're pretty much supposed to be like Aquaman's like assistants or mercenaries. At the very end of the Black Manta trailer, it has a very similar like ending scene where it's Black Manta and then it has a few different skins to his side as well, which those are supposed to be his mercenaries. And it's pretty much supposed to show like Black Manta and his army against Aquaman and his army which of course his army is showing those unreleased fish stick skins it's a simple fact that of course it's the fish stick skin which everyone knows and loves here in the community it's one of the more popular skins that we have in the game but for me i think it's also the fact that they kind of have like this gold armor on and i just think it looks really really nice like the fish stick has so many different styles and variants at this point but honestly whenever this does come out into the game we get a better look i think this might be my new favorite fish version out of everyone that we've seen in the game, which like I said, there is a bunch. And I thought it was really cool that Fortnite kind of just threw these in there as like background characters. Like I said, a lot of people saw this trailer when Aquaman first got released, but didn't even realize all the little hidden Easter eggs and teasers like the Atlantis POI in the background and also this unreleased version of the fish stick skin, which looks really good. And although nothing is 100% confirmed, a lot of people in the community are assuming that these are actually going to be free styles or free versions that we are going to be getting added into the game the next time the fish stick skin comes out as well wait is that actually that wait what oh my god i actually i can't believe i why was he in the tree no come back there we go all right, let's go get these guys. There's a heli over here. So in terms of a release date for this style, uh, we don't really know exactly when Fishstick is going to be coming back into the shop. And like I said, at the moment, we also don't really know what the name of the skin is actually going to be either. But all I know is I am very excited for this style to be coming out into the game because I think it looks really good. Oh God, there's a lot of them here actually. Yo, I need some backup over here, teammates. Oh, let's go. Good teamwork, guys. Good teamwork. That's what I like to see right there, fellas. That's what I like to see. And just because I'm curious, let me know your guys' thoughts and feedback down in the comments as well based on all the different styles we have for the fish stick skin because I'm pretty sure that skin has the most unique different styles out of every other skin in the game which is crazy to think about but of all the different styles and obviously this leaked one that's going to be coming out here very soon which one is your favorite like i said for me personally i think this new one uh that's themed towards aquaman looks amazing with like the gold armor and everything it makes him look like a warrior but let me know your thoughts and feedback down below i'm really curious now the next hidden reward that we are going to be taking a look at today is also another skin that was featured in the Fortnite map like I'm not even joking as of right now you could literally find this on the map and it's actually going to be coming out and this skin is actually tied in with the car update which supposedly is supposed to drop tomorrow I know the car update has been very very anticipated and obviously it's going to add a lot of brand new changes into the game in terms of like a brand new vehicle mobility a lot of the vehicles are going to take gas now which is going to be a brand new mechanic which I'm excited about but the reward and skin that I am talking about is actually known as the crash test dummy skin now some of you guys might have heard about this and like I said you could literally you could actually find this skin on the Fortnite map it's like a little hidden Easter egg I'll throw images up on the screen in case you guys have not seen this for yourselves yet but just as the name implies it's literally a skin based around being a crash test dummy which if you guys didn't know 
car companies use these to test how safe the cars are going to be in different types of crashes and situations. Now, I don't know about you guys, but I think the skin's awesome. It's very unique. It has like a very distinguished look and color scheme to it, which I think is really cool. And although it's not 100% confirmed if this is going to be a free reward, a part of a challenge set when the car update does come out, or if it's just going to be released into the shop when the car update does come out, since it is a crash test dummy skin, it is going to be linked with the car update. And I'm almost 100% certain that when the car update does come out, this skin is going to be available available to either get purchased in the item shop or it's going to be a part of like a challenge set or a hidden easter egg that we're able to earn for free oh wait i think it was marauders those are definitely marauders builds but where do they go someone must have eliminated them or something yep there's the culprit oh i dinked this guy in the head you are done sir yeah that's what i thought dude i knew he was weak i was just waiting for him to poke up he got cocky with that RPG. <laughs> oh. Okay. He had Ocean's Burst and the Chuggy Jug. I'll take that. That's a lot of loot. And I see someone over there. And then there's also someone rolling up on it with a helicopter. Yo, shoot it. It's really weak. Yeah, he's dead. He's going to die. Oh, they were in water. Well, he's still dead. <laughs> Dude, Ocean's Burst is just too good. This thing is so good. The bloom is so accurate. All right. <laughs> he tried running away. Why would you run away? Oh, he had a charged shotgun too. That looks nice. It was Kit's charged shotgun. Oh, we have good loot now. We are looted up to the max now. I think I see it. There's an enemy over here. I swear I saw someone over here. Boom! Yeah, get out of my lobby, brother. Get out of my lobby. Kit's charge shotgun is too... Dude, it's too good, actually. This thing is actually really good. All right, well, it's a 3v1. We just got to find this last guy. 3v1. Let's not choke this, boys. Let's not choke this. Well, there's some marauders over here. On the zip line. Oh, there we go. I was about to say, I was like, there's no way. It's a 3v1, and he had all those marauders shooting at him. But let's go, baby. Ocean's Burst is low-key. I think that's the best shock or the best AR in the game. How many limbs did we get? 13. Wow, it didn't even feel like that. Let's go. That was a pretty good game. All right, well, that is like after you guys in today's video, ending it off on a good note after I got absolutely destroyed in Blitz Solos. I'm going to have to redeem myself off camera. There's no way I'm letting that be the last game of Solos I play. But what I want you guys to do is let me know down in the comment section, are you guys excited for the 13.3 update that's supposed to come out tomorrow? Who knows if it actually is? Uh, sometime this week, for sure, it's going to drop. We're going to be getting the implementation of cars and the crash test dummy skin. And we also have that brand new version of the fish stick, which looks amazing. Hopefully that comes out whenever the fish stick rotates throughout the item shop, which is in these next few days as well. But we really don't know. But I hope you guys are excited for that as well. That is all I got for you guys in today's video. If you enjoyed, do not forget to drop a like. Subscribe to the channel if you are brand new. And I will see you guys in the next one. Take it easy, my friends.